I'm going to show you how to read out a clock using Pydex and generate a file that can be uploaded to AUE wind speed. So right now I've set up a test race and go on ahead and clock the bird on it and now we're going to go ahead and go to evaluate the race. So the first thing you need to do is get the clock in there and go to evaluate the evaluation tab on Pydex. Uh, down here at the bottom you can see where we need to read out the clock. So we read out the clock. And it goes ahead and it uploads the information out of the clock. You can tell when it does it because we have the option up here to select a race. So we're going to select race number one. And it's going to pull it up and it's going to show the bird and it's going to show the arrival time. Uh, then we're going to go down here when the icon that says WS with the checkered flag behind it. It's build wind speed file. We're going to click on it. And when you're uploading them to eWindSpeed, you need to know exactly which file folder you're looking at. So we've always used our Addis file, which unfortunately I don't see right here right now, but we'll just put it in 22, 2022 Old Birds. And you can see the wind speed export format is .doo, and you simply save the file, and it's done. So we'll go here and go to 2022 Old Birds, and there's our file right there. So you just pick the folder that you want. I, since I didn't have one created, I went ahead and just threw it into here. But anyway. That's all there is to it, and you go ahead and you'll pop the next clock in and read it out and save it into the same file. And after you do that, you're going to want to open AUE Wind Speed and go through the process of uploading them there. There's already a video on my channel of uploading them to the AUE Wind Speed program.